Hi everyone. So I recently decided to upgrade my mic. I had a Bluetooth wireless mic, but I decided to upgrade to the SmartLav Plus mic. And you can find out why I did that in my previous video, which I will link up top. I found a lot of recommendations for this mic. So just before I decided to take the plunge and buy this mic, I was a little bit concerned because I read that Rode prefers iOS devices. And I also read that you need to have an audio app to be able to use it. And I thought, well, I don't just want to record audio, I want to film. And so I was thinking, well, maybe it's possible to find an audio and a video app in one. And Rode does provide that, but only for iOS users. So they're really lucky because they can actually film and then they can totally like adjust their gain, things like that. Whereas me, I've got no way of actually hearing what the gain is like. I can adjust the volume level though as I go to edit the video. So yeah, it's good enough for me. Hopefully you're liking the volume so far. I actually have some builders working right across the road. So this is a good way to test if it's doing a good job of cutting out some external noises. But yeah, you may be in a similar situation. You may have an Android device and you may be like, is it possible to use this? A microphone on my phone. I think the rule of thumb is if you have a 3.5 millimeter port you should be good to go otherwise you should be able to find an adapter that will make it work for you. Also if you are an iOS user even though this video isn't really focused on that you may need a lightning adapter. I actually received a TRS to TRRS adapter Sorry, I was supposed to hold it here for you, but it doesn't matter. I will add links to these adapters in the description below, but you may just want to check with a Rode dealer or you know, look into it a bit more for your particular phone, just to make sure that you actually need these uh, adapters. But yeah, the two adapters I got, I think they actually have to work together. So it's possible that if you do have an iOS device, you may need both the Lightning adapter and the TRS adapter. I actually was wanting to give you a proper list of Android devices that do work for this mic and there was a list on the Rode website but every time I try to click on it it just shows me a blank page. So if anyone has a list that would be great feel free to add that in the comments below. I wouldn't be too nervous about it. I think with the right adapter you should be able to get it to work. Another thing that you can buy is a system which is called wireless go that's one example where you connect your wired microphone to a transmitter and that connects to a receiver so it allows you to film at a distance of up to 70 meters for that you will need a trr to a tr adapter however one issue i do have with this microphone is that the cord is very short for those who follow me you will see that i'm filming at a much closer distance than i normally do you can get an extension cord. I'm not sure if I'm going to bother doing that because I do have other microphones I could use and yeah, it's okay. I mean, it will, it will help if I actually don't tuck the wire underneath my shirt. It will make it a little bit more of a distance. Generally speaking though, I'm going to be using this mic for my geometry tutorials and I can always switch back to my Blue Yeti mic, which I absolutely love, and I'll also provide a link to that in the description below. If any of you are looking to purchase a mic, please do so via my links, because I will get a small commission, and yeah, that's yet to happen for me, but hopefully it will. <laughs> I just signed up to be an affiliate marketer. I definitely won't be spamming people all the time with links, but every now and then, if there's a product that I use myself and that I recommend, I will share it in the description of my videos below, because why not? So thank you for watching. I hope that this video was a little bit informative for you. I'm no tech expert, but hopefully it helps ease your worries a bit if you had questions similar to what I had. And I'm going to be creating a series of these mic videos. So definitely come back or subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. The next ones will be fun because I'm going to head outside and I'm going to test these microphones with and yeah, also film without a mic. And I'm also going to compare this mic to my other mic just to see the difference in quality. So yeah, please subscribe and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye for now.